In this video I'm going to show you how you can do this really cool video in text effect in DaVinci Resolve. Before making this video I could only find other instruction videos on doing it in Adobe Premiere. But the good news is it's really easy to do in Resolve and takes about 5 minutes. So stay tuned and I'll show you how. You can see here I've got a selection of running clips on the timeline that I've previously dragged in. You can see the clips are all slightly different lengths as we need that for the effect we want. So the first thing we're going to do is create some text. Um, so we just pick a font. I'm just using Arial. Um, it may not be the best font for this, but it's just for demonstration purposes. So type the word run. And then we're just going to resize it so that it fills up the whole screen. Now we're going to copy that and paste it three times. And then we're going to drag each text layer under the videos. We'll now stretch the text layers out to the length of the videos. And as you can see, the videos are just on top of the text layer. What we want to do though is we go up to the composite mode here and for each video we go to multiply. So for the next clip we do it again. And then the final clip. You'll see that that's put the video in the text. We can now play around with the video and center it over the letter we want. We can zoom it, crop it, pretty much do what we want until you're happy with it. But we'll go back to the original one that I've done. We'll now select the text layer and the video clip for each one and do new compound clip. and give it a name. We can now see the compound clips are in the media pool. We'll then delete the ones we've got from the timeline and then import them again onto the timeline. As working with them directly, uh, I found a little bug there. Maybe it's just my computer. We'll just line them up on the timeline. And now we need to do a right hand crop to reveal the respective letters. So on the first video, we just crop, crop right and you can see it's revealing. Now the same for the next clip down. And again, you can see it's revealing. And there's no need to do anything for the last one because you can see everything is now revealed. And when we play it back, we've got all the running action going on together. But if we want this to come one after the other, we just arrange our clips. 
in the order that we want. And that's pretty much it guys. Um, really, really easy to do. Please check out my other videos on my channel and thank you for watching.